Guys, good morning. By the way, it's 10.51 and it is Friday, which is crazy, but the days are just going by so fast. I made this avocado toast. Look how good it looks. I made this avocado toast with a latte. I've been getting these avocado toasts from um, this cafe. And I'm like, I can literally make this at home. So I've been working on it and this, I perfected it. So I mash up avocado, I'll show you guys. I think I showed you guys already, actually. But I mash up avocado, add a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and then um, I boiled an egg and then cut it up and then just added red pepper flakes on top. So amazing. And then I got this sourdough bread from Whole Foods yesterday. But before this, I was just putting it on regular bread. So we'll see. So I'm kind of still full. I'm not even hungry. But I'm going to just take a bite of this. I toasted my bread. So good. I used to be obsessed with County Crazy's avocado toast, and I found out that they add a little bit of Dijon mustard. I didn't have any Dijon mustard, or else I would have added a little bit, just like the smallest amount. But it's honestly perfect, just this. I feel like you don't ever have to do too much with avocado toast. If I had lemon, I would have added a little bit of the lemon. But it's so good. Just like simple, easy to make, healthy. Oh, look at him trying to drink all of my smoothie. Guys, he's getting so big. Like he's drinking. Out of a straw. <laughs> Is that Betty? He's probably gonna try to drink this whole thing. Watch. I'm gonna update you guys in like 10 minutes and we'll see where he's at with it. Still going strong. Look, he almost finished it, y'all. He really almost finished it. That's why I'm like, when I make smoothies now, I'm about to just start making two because my smoothie, my smoothie is gone. It's gone. You drink all my smoothie. Are you done with it? Are you done? <laughs> After I take it. <laughs> Baby, you're done! What a damn shame. Y'all see how fast he's drinking this? <laughs> this has me weak.
We just got back, y'all. I definitely tanned. I got some color. I don't know why my camera looks so dark. Did you get a tan? Hey guys, I am. We got back from the pool a little bit ago. I am about to clean up a little bit because after the pool, I was worn out. So I just, we both lay down. I ate some food, or we both ate, and just chilled for a hot second. Now I'm about to clean up. I'm waiting to get this mop replaced. So I can mop my floor, but I don't know where it's at. The lady is saying something about she dropped it off or something, but I don't have it. So, but then it says still heading to you. So I don't know what's going on. So I'm about to take my focus gummies because I forgot to take them today. And my CD gummies. But ah! <laughs> so I'm about to clean up from yesterday. I cleaned up already yesterday, and then when Lucy came over, we like cooked and got everything basically dirty again. So I'm cleaning up from yesterday. And I just ordered some stuff. I just ordered some new like plates and stuff from Amazon and like dishes and like servingware because now that I'm doing like cooking, like I'm cooking more and I'm doing like cooking TikToks and stuff and I want to be have a really cute aesthetic and I want all my stuff to be really cute. And the dishes I've had, I've had those since like my first place in Atlanta. So, um, sorry, no. I've had those since my first place in Atlanta, so I was just trying to get some new stuff. And I got some like coffee things. Just so, just so you know, I could all be more aesthetic and pleasing to the eye. So, we did that. But other than that, that is it. I have to go to the store in a little bit to go get Priest some milk. And what else did I need? I needed to get him milk. Something else. Oh. I wanted to get some food for later. And I'm going to get some more avocado. Today's goals that I set out will be accomplished and successful. and opinions. I look forward to new with kindness. I feel like I have a special purpose in this world that I have a special I am calm. Today, I choose to be happy. It was yesterday. I am grateful gay positive thoughts are deep rooted into my mind. And no negative thoughts will take hold. Every for my greatest struggles. My ability to today positive energy and joy. Hey guys, we're gonna be talking about the Sweet Nights Starry Night mattress. This is gonna be a king size mattress. It has a star cover design, which gives you a sense of peace and relaxation. Has great quality fabric materials. Also, this mattress is gonna have four layers. So the first layer is going to be a gel infused heat transfer foam. The second layer is a high density memory foam. Third, tempered pocket coil support. Fourth is going to be a base foam layer as well. It enhances support and has minimal movement disturbance. Get another angle. You can really see the design and everything on here. But super comfortable. This is four layers. So the top is going to be this like design. And this is a starry night design. So this is like really 
it gets you ready to go to sleep, honestly. It's super comfortable. Obviously, you're going to put a sheet on here, but it's very comfortable. It's very easy on the eyes. It's like, put you in a tranquil state, you know? So I love the design. It's super cute. The first is a gel-infused heat transfer foam, and the second is a high-memory density foam. The third is a tempered pocket coil, and then the fourth is a base foam layer. You do not need a topper on this. For all of my mattresses, I usually get a topper, and for this, you do not need a topper. So this has really good support if you are a... If you are a back sleeper or if you sleep on your side. It just really molds to your body. It feels so good, y'all. Or if you sleep on your stomach as well, which I tend to do. I love sleeping on my stomach. So it's honestly puts me to sleep every time. Stomach or I'm a side sleeper as well. For the gel transfer layer, y'all, it also supports cool sleeping, so. Game changer. This mattress is on sale for $500 and I also have a discount code for you guys as well. So if you're looking, if you're in the market for a new mattress, this is going to be the mattress for you, okay? This is going to be a king size mattress. So of course I'll have everything linked in the description for you guys. And if you have any questions, leave a comment and I will make sure to get back to y'all. So let me know what you think. Hey guys, come with me to do a content day. I'm gonna uh, vlog my content day. I haven't done one in a while, but I really don't want to do one, but I am forcing myself to do one and I am helping Nisi with her brand, so I'm gonna take some pictures for her. Um, I did my hair earlier and I did my makeup. I did, I don't know, I wanted to do something different with my hair instead of doing a bun, but right now buns are what I like best with my hair. My hair is at such a awkward length, so when I straightened my hair, I was like, I absolutely hate it, and I hated every style I try to put it in, so I just naturally put it in a bun because that's just what I'm most comfortable with right now, and that's what I feel like looks best on me currently, so that's what I did. But it's okay because my buns always look more sleek and better when my hair is straightened out. So I didn't straighten my hair for nothing. This looks great. Okay, I need to do my makeup um, videos against this wall right here because this is great lighting. And it's just a plain... I'm glad I found this. I'm, I'm with this process. Okay. Anyway, I am taking pictures in two dresses. I was gonna do content in my brand, but I just don't have the energy today. So whenever I get my inventory, I'm gonna do like a bunch of content. I'm gonna have a separate content day dedicated to that. So I'm excited for that. But I'm gonna take some pictures in this mesh key stuff that I have. So let's get to it. It's probably going to be, we're probably going to do this for the whole day until it gets dark. It is 4 o'clock, so I'm about to pack my stuff up and we're about to go. So yeah, I'll pack my stuff with you guys. Uh, it's, 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 uh, I got Priest ready. As you can see, he looks very cute, per usual. I'm bringing these nude heels. I'm just bringing like neutral heels. I'm bringing these nude heels. And then these, I haven't worn these yet. They're so cute. These are from Miss Lola. They sent these to me and I have not worn these. They lost a few of the rhinestones from moving, but I am gonna wear them for my picks. I'm bringing these two dresses. This is, they're both from Meshki. So adorable. Does this not give Miami all the way? So cute. This is like beach club in Dubai. Or even out here, honestly. It's so cute. So I'm going to pack these. And then we're going to get on the road. Okay, so the diaper's right there. What else? I was going to add lip gloss. Yes. Okay, period. We love that. Let me get my lip liner. Just start to freshen it up if I need to. <laughs> it just might be a
I'm about to go to the pool. Um, I'm waiting for Chris to wake up, so I'm just getting myself together while I wait for him. So I got these. I'm about to put on some lashes because I'm over the no lash look. And I got some lip stains. I ordered some lip stains from TikTok shop because I think they are absolutely amazing. And if I don't have to reapply lip liner or just like maintenance, y'all, like great maintenance. So I got colors Hazel and Clover. I don't know which one I want to try. I'm going to try Hazel first because it's like a natural, a more natural. And then Clover is supposed to be darker so I can do that like when I go out or something. I have a lip plumper on now. So I'm going to take that off and then we're going to try it. Don't mind my bed, y'all. I'm washing my sheets. I'm washing my sheets and I have clothes to put away. So... That's what we're doing today when we get back from the pool. Okay, let me get these open, girl, because... This is what the packaging looks like. Let's read the directions really quick. How to use using the precision tip applicator. Trace along the lip line in an even layer. Leave on for up to 20 minutes. After formula has set, use fingers to slowly peel the film tint off to unveil smudge proof long wear lip color. Okay, so let's get into it. Okay, y'all, I'm going to do my top lip off camera so I don't mess this up. I think I'm supposed to do, I think I'm supposed to do another layer too, so let's just go over it again. Hopefully I am not messing this up. All right, so we're gonna wait 20 minutes and we'll be back. Okay, I did a little outfit change. Priest is awake, so we're going to hurry this up so we can go. Oh, it's just peeling off, okay. The bottom looks dark. But obviously it'll probably fade throughout the day. Yeah, this is darker than I expected. But I'm just gonna I'm just gonna pair it with this like pinky gloss from Boxum. And it's called April. So I'll show you guys what it looks like in about an hour. I just got me and Priest together. So I'm about to put some powder under my eye because I need it. I was going to try not to or try my makeup without it, but it's just not getting that. <laughs> I'm about to go to the grocery store so I can make something. I put that lip stain on. All right, just took it off actually just now. I did a TikTok for it and I just took it off. I need to get, I want to get like an even more natural one. They have, they have one called pink and I want to try that because it's a little bit more natural. 
but it looks good overall and it fades a little bit so and it lasts all day so nonetheless i love it I'm not sure what we're gonna do today. I'm not gonna do anything excessive today. I really just wanna like pour it into my cup today. I kinda wanna go to the nail salon, but I just don't know if I have the patience for that. I need to go so bad because my nails are horrendous, but I don't know. I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna um, get organized and then when I do, we're gonna go to the grocery store and then we'll probably take a little walk and then stop at the grocery store and then I'm gonna figure out what I wanna do with my day. Not me wanting to throw my Stanley away. I, you know how like they say there's iron in Stanleys, like if it gets damaged, the iron or not iron. I'm sorry. Is it iron? What is it? It's. What the fuck is it? I don't think it's iron. Lead. There's lead in Stanleys, and if it gets damaged, they're saying that that's the only way you can be exposed to lead if your cup is damaged. Why am I, I have ice in my freezer. Why am I over here trying to break the ice up with my Stanley? So I'm like, now this is going in the trash because we're not trying to get lead poisoning. <laughs> but I've been meaning to get a new cup anyway because lead poisoning is crazy. I'm throwing this away too. And I am gonna go get one of those like hydro flasks or whatever at Whole Foods when I go because those don't have any lead in them. So we are venturing on some Stanley Cups. And nobody needs to be paying $40 for a cup that you can get from Target or Walmart for probably 10 or 12. They all do the same thing. Literally all of them do the same thing. And the fact that Stanley Cups have that lead that you can potentially like be exposed to just is insane to me. Like why would you put lead in a cup you're paying $40 for? It doesn't make sense. So yeah, I remember, I don't know. I just feel like people be like breaking their backs trying to get these Stanley Cups. One time I went to Dunkin' and this lady, I had my Stanley in the car and this lady was like, um, can I see that cup? And I was like, yeah. And I let her see it or whatever. And she was like, she was like, I just don't understand the hype. Forty dollars is crazy, but you know, I'm gonna get one one day. Um, da, 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 da. And I'm like, no, it's not even worth it. It's not even worth it. Don't spend your hard-earned money on it because it's not even worth it. It's gonna do the same thing. It's a good cup. I'm not gonna lie, but it's just the whole concept of it like you can get the same cup for twelve dollars and it's gonna do the same exact thing my stanley still like i don't know why people like are bent on these stanley cups because my stanley leaks so much like i can't tell you how many times it's leaked all over my bed or my floor if it falls like it leaks like there's nothing that you need this cup so badly for that another cup can't do the same thing it, you're just buying the logo at this point and it's not even it's not even like that girl so switch the that if you don't have a stanley you don't need to get one it's not that great i'm about to go get me another cup if they have something if they have a hydro flask or something cheaper i'm probably gonna get the cheapest option because it's just a water bottle at the end of the day so yeah um, I'm about to go listen to my morning affirmations outside. Please to sleep. So I really want to just like work on me today, like pour into myself. So I'm gonna go sit outside, get some fresh air while Priest is asleep, and like work do my morning affirmations because I didn't do them earlier, and I actually want to like write them down and do that um, and kind of just refresh. So let's go do that now. <laughs>
change my affirmations. I didn't do the full hour because my wrist is starting to hurt. But I feel really great. I feel really motivated. I'm really glad I just sat down and like wrote those down. If I could do this every single morning, just come out here with my coffee and do my morning affirmations before Priest wakes up, I will literally take over the world. Because <laughs> that's how it makes you feel. And I feel like it's really important to pour into yourself before anyone else, especially in the morning time. Well, obviously in the morning, like when you wake up, it is super important to do that. So you need to pour into yourself before your boyfriend, before your man, before your kids, before your family. Like you need to pour into yourself because if you do not, you will not be able to be the best mom that you can, the best wife that you can, or the best friend or person that you can be for that day or just period. So I think that's super important. I always try to do that. But anywho, I don't know if you guys can even hear me because I'm outside, but it just feels so amazing outside today. So I'm about to go to the store now or when Priest wakes up. I've showed you guys this before, but this is the one that I listen to on Audible. I haven't really, I've tried, I think like one or two and just didn't hit the same. This is an hour long. But I want to listen to some other ones so I don't burn that one out and I can just get like more affirmations, you know, like expand my affirmations. But anyway, I will see you guys a little bit later. Which ones to get? these baby I just got home. I got this mommy boost uh, drink from Whole Foods. I don't know what it's about, but we're going to try it because, you know, anything helps. That was a lot. Um, it has apples, carrots, beets, ginger, limes, spinach. It looks really cute. That's really why I got it because it looks good. It does not look how it tastes. You would think that this is like fruity. It's not. It tastes very gingery. Very gingery. With a hint of sweet. But you know, ginger is good for you, so we're gonna go with it. <sighs> I got this hydro flask. It was still $40, y'all, yeah, so. I might order, I'm not gonna, no I'm not. I was gonna, I honestly, I would have ordered something off of Amazon, but I needed something today because that's literally my main source of water. I don't have water bottles or anything and I don't like drinking out of like the small cups because I constantly have to refill them. So we just got that. Okay, that comes off like that, how do you? And this looks like, honestly, this looks like it won't spill. We'll see though. This is 40 ounces as well. So I need to wash that for now. I'm gonna get a small cup. Um, and drink some water because I'm just so thirsty. It's so hot today. It felt amazing earlier and now it's like scorching hot. Priest, priest, I'm going to make a 
fettuccine. I know I always make fettuccine. I, I feel like I have to have fettuccine like once a month. I'm obsessed with fettuccine. So I'm making that with shrimp. I don't know why I always want fettuccine, y'all, and I never order it on DoorDash because it's always gross. Do you want a little fruit bar? So I'm gonna make that for. I don't know if I'm gonna make that now or if I'm gonna wait. I kinda wanna go take a picture, get some content for a quick set. I got cheesecake because they're so good and their cornbread. Their cornbread is surprisingly good. I needed more bananas. And I just don't know what I want to eat right now. I had avocado toast earlier. What is it? It's true. So I don't. Hey y'all. So I tried to go get my license earlier, or just now, but um, I went to the wrong office. I thought the place that I was going to was the right office, and it wasn't. So y'all know it's always something when it comes to going and getting some kind of government form. So I'm going to go tomorrow. So I'm about to go edit some stuff and just be productive. Oh, I'm brought to take Zuri and Priest on a little walk and sit at a little coffee shop and that is about it I just wanted to update you guys um, on our day it is Tuesday April 2nd it's 1 30 I am hungry y'all I'm trying to I made um, this fettuccine last night which was so good and I left it out and I'm really upset about it So I don't know what we're going to eat today or actually I do I want to make this chicken and red beans and rice so I'm going to make that today I'm about to get myself organized I'm about to put my computer and pack all our stuff up and we're about to head out
that hit your arm? <laughs> no, I'm over here talking to you and I'm getting no response. Did you say something else before that? Yeah. Wait, put your arms back where they were. Yeah. It gives Kylie the
Novocaine, Novocaine, Murder, murder, she Murder, she I got things that's a pretty round this time I'm here, I can't 